All right, all right. Hey, everybody, welcome to the Avena Lounge. Give yourselves a round of applause. Another sold out show. We've done it. The seats are filled. So here's how it's going to work. Everybody come up here, crush your time. Make sure you stick to the amount of time that you're given. Uh, we're going to give you the red light in the back. If you see that the red light is on and you didn't see it turn on, get the hell off stage. We're all tired of listening to you. Um, I personally uh, don't like to offend very many people, although uh, it's tough because our generation is so politically correct, you know? Like, I was in Brooklyn and I was with my friends and I was trying to find a place to eat and I found a restaurant that I thought looked kind of normal. So I was like, oh, we gotta eat at that restaurant. That one. The one that's right next to that Jew. <laughs> and my friend just lost it. He was like, yo, you can't say that, man. That's racist. Why does he gotta be a Jew? Like the Hasidic guy, <laughs> the Orthodox Jewish man, why is he a Jew? I don't know, the curly burns, the fuzzy hat, he's fiddling on a roof right now. <laughs> he's a Jew. There's nothing racist about that statement. Now if I had said something like, get him, I mean that's racist, you're not allowed to do that. <coughs> Okay, so our next comic uh, had to run out of here, so we're just gonna skip him and move right along. Your next comic is very funny because he has a very funny name, so apologies to all the vegans and anyone who ordered a cheeseburger. Josh Hamburger, everybody, give it up for him. Josh Hamburger. Uh, so yeah, my last name really is Hamburger. Uh, and the thing about having a last name like that is that everyone has a different joke for you, right? Most of them are bad, like that cheeseburger joke, you know, not that funny. Oh, come on. But some of them are good. Uh, like, when you were born, did the doctor hand you off to your parents and tell them your hamburger is ready, <laughs> right? It's a funny joke. Uh, some of them, people don't realize they're dirty until they say them out loud. Like, oh, hamburger, can I eat your meat? Uh, oh, hamburger, can I put my meat between your buns? Like, what I'm trying to say is I'm not a piece of meat. <laughs> you know. uh, so I'm pretty lazy. Um, a lot of people think that's a bad thing, but I disagree. Because like, what if Hitler was lazy? <laughs> you know? Like, what if John Wilkes Booth got up, looked around, and just said, meh. <laughs> Basically, next time you want to scold me for being lazy, think about how many ways I could be killing you right now. So I like toes. Uh, not in like a fetish sort of way, just uh, I think I appreciate them more than other people. Uh, people kind of consider toes to be like the fingers, loser, burnout brothers, you know? Like the fingers are out here, you know, they do stuff, they can rock, good job, they have spirit, right? And the toes are kept in the basement of the body. And we're so ashamed of them that we lock them in socks and shoes and tie the laces so they can't get out. And down there doing whatever it is they do, you know? playing video games, masturbating. I don't know what they do down there. I also respect cavemen. And not for inventing the wheel or discovering fire or anything like that, but because if it were up to me to continue the existence of the human race, I don't think I could have boned a cave woman. <laughs> like a Middle Easterner is about as hairy as I'll go. Is that racist? Yes. Everything nowadays is racist. Even when you make fun of non-racists. Like, you make fun of a Jew, that's racist. Jew isn't a race. I know white Jews, black Jews, brown Jews. What do they have, two races? No. Race should only be determined by the color of your skin. And that is racist.
Uh, that's all I got. Thanks. Give it up for Josh Hamburger, everybody. Josh Hamburger. All right, guys, that's our show. Thank you so much for coming out. Uh, make sure you join us next week and tell better jokes. Good night, everyone. Good night. Dude. Hey, man, great set. Yeah, likewise. Yeah. I really like that new joke that you were working on. Oh, which one? Um, it was the one about the crocodile. Hey, man. Oh, yeah, hey, yeah that was cool. Hey. Oh, dude, the, the head wax one, that was really funny. Oh, thanks. Yeah, yeah. yeah I try to work with it. Yeah, I've seen you working on that for the past week. You've been yeah. hitting a lot of the mics. Well, I'm trying to make the setup a little more clear, but yeah. like, people know that I'm bald. So. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty yeah. clear. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. Yeah. I really appreciate that. Yeah. It's, really, it's getting more clear every day. Yeah, yeah and okay. I think with you get it in front of like a real audience instead of just a bunch of comics, then yeah. it's really going to look Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, yeah. I mean these guys did want to laugh. Like yeah. That. yeah. Hey. hey. Uh, sorry I made fun of your joke. That's, no, dude. It was, I thought that was really mean. It's totally fine. No, it was really good. You got, uh, you got a good thing going with the uh, sarcasm, too. You should stick with that. You really nice. push forward with it, you know? It'd Maybe be good. you should uh, like make fun of yourself a little more, though, before you make fun of other people. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. That's something I can do. Yeah. It was just my first time, so I was a little First time here? Uh, first time ever. Really? Ever? Yeah. Uh, could not tell. You couldn't see me shaking? <laughs> no. I mean, just keep with it, you know? It'll get better. Nice. Yeah, you'll do good. Yeah, yeah nice set. By the way, that joke at the end that you were telling, that yeah. was really good. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Saw it. yeah, that was hilarious. I wanted that to be my closer forever, but I have I not been able to make it work. You, oh, it totally I think works. You got it. Yeah, it yeah. works great. Yeah. yeah.